Welcome to IBC 2022. It's been three long years since the world's most inspiring content and technology event occurred in Amsterdam. And Broadcast is here in Europe to engage with each other, unlock business opportunities, discover the latest innovations, and explore the exciting world of content. Ashley with In Broadcast. Joining me is Samir of ST Engineering iDirect. Hello. Hello. Hi. So can you tell me a little bit about what's going on currently in the market with your company? So uh, we have a history, a heritage, 35 years of heritage in the broadcast environment. And this is what has brought up to this show. And uh, in addition, we also have a leading position in the satellite uh, equipment. So the combination of broadcast and satellite has given us really uh, an enviable market share in the broadcast. Yes. And what trends are you currently noticing right now in the media and broadcasting industry? So we've noticed an uh, increasing amount of development in the cloud, especially on the, on the contribution side, where you need to shoot uh, content uh, up in the mountains in very remote areas and where you need to provide connectivity. And the second thing that we see as well is an increased uh, amount of over-the-top content, in, whether it's in mobile networks or fixed networks as well, and that is only going to increase over the years. And so what are you currently focusing on right now? So here today, for example, what we're showcasing two products uh, along, in addition to the other products we have, those focusing on, on broadcast. So we have the MCX uh, 8000, which builds on our history of um, of the MDM 6100 and MCX 7000. And we're also showcasing a Skyflow, which is an ecosystem where we have different vendors helping us, uh, putting, uh, who have thus helped us put the solution together. So we have an easy broadcast who's focusing on things related to content management and rendering on the device. And we have EKT, they have a setup box or the customer premises equipment where you can store the content and it can be retrieved. And of course, we provide a satellite solution so that it really allows you to expand the scope of the, of the whole solution. Very nice. And can you tell us a little about what we can expect to see from you in the near future? So uh, those projects, for example, are really focusing around uh, DTH towers or uh, OTT content delivery. And it really leveraged the, uh, the satellite multicasting capability of satellites. So over the years, what we're going to see is certainly an increase in the consumption of OTT content. And what we're going to see very likely is um, the blending of technologies like 5G and cloud, and these are going to dominate. And we think that we really have an edge with those solutions that we have in addressing uh, the clogging that's going to happen in the mobile networks, for example and delivering content closer to where the, con the consumer is. So there's very low latency, ultra fast service, and uh, increase or enhance very high quality of experience, actually. Very nice. Well, thank you so much for all that information, thank and it was you. great seeing you today. Thank you.